Saturday night at Wembley was the most unbelievable night. When I finished New York, New York, I could see in the corner of my eyes that everyone was starting to stand up. I never thought in a million years that I'd get a standing ovation at Wembley for dancing. This is the most incredible feeling. It's one of my highlights of my life. Who would believe that six weeks ago you nearly left this competition? Oh. Look at you now, a giant. Seven. Nine. A fitting finale for a fantastic <laughs> yeah. night. This week we're doing the Argentine tango. And this is all about you wrapping up being really intimate. The Argentine tango oozes so much sensuality. I just want you to be a little bit more Latin lover. What about that? No. Not sexy? Dreadful. It's there, I just have to bring it out in him. It's not sexy enough, it's not what I want. The Sheffield lad has to produce sexiness this week. Hola, Natalie. It's more like it. I'm gonna take it to Buenos Aires. Lovely dish. Watch it. <laughs> On Saturday night, I've got to forget Sheffield. I have to get myself into Argentina. Come on, Julio. Oh, yeah, hello. Ooh. It's gonna be hot. Dancing the Argentine Tango. Michael Vaughan and Natalie Love. Okay, Bruno, straight in with you. Michael, the look of painful concentration on your face! <laughs> that wasn't sexy, it looked like you were passing a kidney stone. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't sexy, it wasn't sensual, it was like a series of steps. It was sexy if you watched a broomstick. You know, there was no relationship between you and her oh. at all. You were concentrating so much in trying to get through the routine that it lost any sense of sexuality and fluidity. It was just a series of steps. You tried hard, but it, it didn't come to an Argentine tango for me. Oh, uh, there you go. OK, Bruno. Uh, Craig? For me, uh, basically, I think it lacked any sort of resistance and lead. It's the man's job to lead the dance and indicate to the woman how to respond to it. And I didn't feel that that was happening, and that happens through the solar plexus, and that's in this particular dance. Your adornments were very stiff as well. Um, it was a good effort, though. I, I think the choreography yeah, was actually yes, it was a, cool, but it just didn't look like an Argentine a, tango. It was a so. good effort. They were all not going no. real away. Yeah, Darcy, Michael, Michael, can you add to that? Yes. You are such an attentive partner. I mean, you concentrate on that. It is brilliant the concentration and then obviously how hard you've worked but again i'd also miss that domineering man that the argentine tango you have to be hungry and passionate for her and i think you were concentrating so much on the moves but i mean still beautiful ease into those lifts 
and, and you, you do, you create some lovely lines and everything. And but I think the concentration on her, but you have to be more Unpowered. arrogant. Unpowered. More arrogant. Oh. Work on the arrogance. Parish. Right, and Lynn. I wish I had a stiff adornment, but <laughs> I can't be helped. Well, that's what he's just said. He didn't have a stiff adornment. Listen, there's two parts to a, every routine. Has got two parts. Part one, you learn the dance. Part two, you come out and perform it. Okay, maybe the performance was lacking a little bit, but it was a full routine. The lifts were good. There was that drag across, the spin on the floor. There was so much good going on. Sometimes uh, these people, uh, I'm a maybe the same as well, you get overwhelmed by one yes. thing. Uh, Craig talks about you've got to lead the dance. The man leads every dance. Why don't you, you talk do about everyone leading the dance? OK, you know, you come out with some stuff. Yeah, it's actually not about that. I was talking about this particular dance. Well, the why woman, don't you talk... But the woman reacts. Virtually none of the men lead any of the pro Yes, but girls. these, but these they particular dancers to... yes, they they just want to get through the room. Hold on. Hold on. I think it's the car park afterwards. Yeah. OK. okay. Oh, oh, yes. oh. Every man for himself, OK. But we finished on Len. That was yes. good, wasn't it? Thank you, That then. gave you Thank heart. You that gave you heart. Off you go, Len. Off you go. Sheffield. The judges have been tough tonight. They're expecting well, so no, much, aren't they? So amazing. We did come out of a turn a little bit early, so we're just trying to hold the rest of the routine back. But, yeah. um, but if you think about the amazing. dance off, I week can't believe three. we created an argument between Len and Craig. Yeah. 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 Well, that's an, that's an achievement. Another one. Another one. Another <laughs> one. <laughs> Since you were in the dance off week three, you've come so far. Do you hand over the mic there? Oh, sorry. Oops, sorry. Okay. You've come so far. <laughs> you know, how does it feel when you go out there and dance? Oh, it's, it's great. I mean, I, I, I did make a couple of mistakes tonight, but. The competition is that good now that you know that if you make mistakes, it could be your last week. So I'll try my best each week. Yeah. Tried it again this week. We've had a great We're week. You know, spending a week dancing like that to Natalie, it's not the hardest thing to do. So. And those lifts, <laughs> spectacular. Amazing. Your signature lifts, they are <laughs> fabulous. Scores are in. The judges' scores are in. Craig Revel Horwood. Six. Ooh. Right. Nice. Darcy Bustle. Seven. Yay! Len Goodman. Yay. Yay. Tom Yoda, six. Hey. Oh. Well, it's not your highest right. score, but it certainly isn't yeah. your lowest. Don't let this be Michael's last tango. <laughs> it's strictly, he'll just be dead upset, won't you, Michael? I dead. Mm -hmm. Right, cool. <laughs> 622. It's a normal thing, Natalie. Right, 622 5204 from your mobile or 09015 225204 from a landline to keep him right here in the ballroom where he belongs. Right, lines open later on. I'll tell you when. Uh, what have we got in store next, Bruce? Right, next.